Hi guys, good day everyone. We are back again today. So today we are going to talk about many things, but you know we are going to talk about the uh, updates because like this upgrade twenty four, I've updated some some of the features. So and that features are what I'm about to tell you guys and how to use them. So like this app now, I created this app using AppGator 24. This is Chat Bosch app. So I created this app using AppGator 24. So but I really need to to make use of this uh, bottom button. If you check where well, you notice that there are some other app that when you are using it, you will not. Let me show you something. Like. Let me show you one thing. You know here, there are some app, mobile app that if you are using them, you will notice that this particular portion now will have bottom button. You know what I mean by bottom button? Now? Yes. Then that that bottom button is what we are going to uh, like implement like this i'm going to teach you how you use it and how to put them and the type of button to use you understand so let's get started we're going to make use of this app to do it same then i would like to go to my app with the 24 login if you have account you log in if you don't have account you can create one then let's go straight to the chat for share app zoom then you come to go to design you can get it here this is design so once you click on that design you will notice that something changed before before you will see something from here to here like this if you check very well you notice that they have added a new feature which is bottom menu you understand so with that button menu now you can you can in fact you can create an, a good app in fact these people they are really trying because this time around we can create app without anyone noticing that this particular app is created using app 24 so that is their main target now let's use it click on that bottom button then you, here they're going to tell you that bottom menu can contain up to five item only up to five item so but the icon to use must be transparent you understand it must have transparent background so they also show you where to get the example like you click this uh, view examples you will see the examples of what they are talking about so you are going to wait while the site opens so this is exactly what they are talking about you can see this all these things are now they, are, they have backgrounds they are transparent like you don't have background picture so you can download any of this now any of this material and use it so up to 4000 icons so but i will still teach you how to get other ones like if you are trying to do something like uh, like uh, music video uh -huh, all those type of icon you may not see it here but i'm going to show you how to get there now let's go back to to where we are Let's go back to where we are. So just after that, you click on show. Show this yes. You check yes. Then here are the menu item. So here you're going to choose the first place is icon. Then here is the title, and here is where it will go to when the uh, the button is clicked. Then how we're we going to do it? What we'll do first of all choose the icon that will display. Let's use the icon. Okay. 
all these other icons like let's the, let's the first one be uh, okay let's say music icon then what I, what what's going to be the title let's put music then once that music music button is clicked then what will happen you, what, will, what will happen then you click here yeah if you select none if you click on that button it's not going to open anything it will just be like that but if you click on open web then it will show you where you're going to paste the url of the website that it will take you to then if you open section then it, the another another option will show where you choose the section all these things are the section in that app so here you're going to choose the particular section that you want to you want to to, to open each time you click on that button so how what are we going to do since we are just using this thing for tutorial let's go let, let's um select um Okay, let's just select the chroma challenge hmm. what are we, what this thing is trying to tell us now is that this music icon once you click on it this is going to be the title that will, that will appear then if you oh, use it by section this particular section will show each time you click on that button this section will show then let's uh, uh, you make use of another one then click on this choose file to choose the file if you really need this button I'm going to drop my, my uh, a link to it so that if you need them then you can st go straight to that place and download all of them I'm going to share it to you now the next one should be let's let's put uh, let's put a news icon let's news icon now here you're going to type in news then what will happen when you went out that a couple is clicked then let's 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 uh, okay let's click on this open web then once that particular this thing is clicked it will take you to this website https Well, okay, let's say Niger Flavor dot com dot ng. Then, if you want this particular uh, link to be open externally, you can check this particular place. You can click it, check it like this. Then like this now if you click on it it will take you to your browser the, the app will close and the browser will open then you can access the site there but it's advisable for you to uncheck this particular option because if your app is using AdMob like you are monetizing the app there's no need to waste that traffic so it's better you the thing open inside the app here yeah, you access it inside the app then your ADS displays then for me i recommend not to check this then what are we going to do let's still put another one this time around we're going to put home button home button then let's say home and um, let's click on section well what will open once that particular home button is clicked let's go social then let's choose another one uh, what else what else okay let's choose video you give it a title video then when you click on the button the session will We'll open and choose the session that is video 
again st put another one what else are we going to to put okay let's put um Which one are we going to use this time around? Okay. Let's put biography. Bio. Let's say open web, open section. You join. Let's put, put it here. So remember, this thing is just for tutorial purposes. Then, if you want to change the styles, you can change it here. But let's try and test what we've done so far to know if it's working for us. Now you save. Then after saving it, then we need to go to that app now to check if what we are what we did worked out. Then let's open the app. Okay. It showed but the color is the problem then let's let's go there and give it a setting let's, let's set it back so that it will look very neat now here we we'll select that same general then but if you want it to to appear very well let's make use of this holo holo then let's save it after saving you then check the app again see if the stuff I've started displaying you can see it it's the, it, the thing is displaying it's displaying 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 so, so this is how to customize your app put the button now let's test what we've done so far yeah okay if you click on uh, this first one which is music it's going to take you to this particular place coma challenge you understand so this is the app this i just developed this app a few days ago so now if you want to read news you can just click at this news you can see that news showed here the name that name that you entered showed here so if the web page is not available okay that is another thing then if you want to watch movies you click at this particular place you see that the movies are this, this, these are the videos available in this app so far then this one is a uh, um the biography icon so that is it that is just it so thank you for watching if you really like what we are doing here in this our channel why not just hit other subscription button so you can join the movement like in this channel i do try all my possible best to make sure that i update you guys with fresh videos and things stuff like this so i still have some other things to teach you like the next video is going to be on how to put login method in upgrade 24 so like there are some application that if you try to log to uh, to open it, the, the thing will show you that it will prompt you that it's a month you're going to log in before any other thing. Now, you see that you log in with your Facebook, with your Gmail, or you you log in directly using your Google Gmail. So all these things are things that we're going to talk about in the next videos. You understand? So just remain calm, remain silent, and um, follow us. You are not going to regret why you were here. So, so about here now, we can also change. You can also change the color of these icons using that particular place that we selected. Holo, you can just click on customize, customize, customize. Let me just let me just show you what I'm talking about. Like if you go back there go back then you will see you see 
if you look at this particular place, there's something I want to show you. Look at this icon now. This icon have background. This this, this particular uh, icon and there's no PNG. It is not PNG icon. You can, you can see other ones here. You can see other ones. They are they, they don't have backgrounds. You understand? But this particular one and have background. If you check it on that app now, you notice that the thing is blank. It's not showing correctly. So so for that we're going to remove it and uh, choose another icon that will fit that will fit that particular place. Um, let's look for we don't have another icon that we don't have another icon here. Yeah. We don't have another icon. We will just make use of it for for the meantime. Maybe let's just let's just use it for now. So here now this place that we selected hollow you can just click uh, this customize then the background should be pure white let's use pure white white let's click on sorry white yeah then the title color if you want to change the title color you can just click any other color that any other color you want let's click uh, yes let's choose this blue you understand so that's just it now we are going to save save it then we need to go back to that app to see if what we just did so far you can see it you see so you can change the color and other things I really need to do there so the reason why this first one is this kind of black or dark is because ah, there's a background there I'm just very very weak I don't know so this is it this is it this is it this is it thank you for watching just make sure you subscribe and wait for the next video that will drop very soon thank you